Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing how to resolve an issue within Windows 10 when you would be opening up a program and you receive an error alert basically stating that this app can't open using the built-in administrator account. So in this tutorial I'll be walking through how to resolve this issue hopefully for all you guys. So there's a couple things we're going to have to do in order for our solution to work. And the first thing would be head over to our search menu in Windows and type in user account control. And then you want to select change user account control settings. It's important that the user account control settings are set to the second option from the top, meaning notify me only when apps try to make changes to my computer. If it's turned off, make sure that you have the user account control enabled. And then once you're done moving this little cursor to the, this position, you want to click on OK. Receive the account control window, uh, select yes. The next step would be to go into the local policy editor. However, Windows 10 Home Edition does not include this feature. So to be inclusive to all users of Windows 10 in this tutorial, we're going to go through the registry in order to make our final change here. So we're going to head over to our start button and we're going to right click on it and then left click on run. Now you want to type in reg edit r-e-g-e-d-i-t all lowercase and then hit enter on your keyboard. You might get a user account control window. You have to be using an administrative account in order to modify the registry here. So then select yes. So I'm going to blow this up full screen here. So you want to go underneath H key local machine and click on the little drop down next to it. And then you want to do the same next to software. And then you want to go down until you get to Microsoft. Again, click on the little arrow next to Microsoft. Then you want to scroll down until you get to Windows. So it'll probably be near the bottom right above Windows Defender. So you want to click on the arrow next to Windows. And then you want to select current version, the arrow next to that. And then scroll down again until you get to policies and then left click on the little arrow next to that. And then left click on the folder that says system. We want to double click on the entry that says filter administrator token. And you want to double click on it. So if the value data says 0, that means it's currently disabled. If we set it to 1, that'll mean it will be enabled. So we're going to just make sure that this is set to 1. So under value data, make sure it says 1 in here. And then click on OK. And at this point, you can close out of the registry editor. And hopefully, you'll be able to successfully open up your program. So I hope this tutorial helped you guys out. And I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.